Bartlesville is a place known for its art. For instance, right over here to the right of me is the Christ Tower, designed by extraordinary architect Frank Lloyd Wright. And now the latest step in artistic development in Bartlesville. Throughout our city, we have these beautiful buffaloes painted by various artists, I believe, throughout the community. Um, these buffaloes are really cool because you can pet them, you can hug them. When you don't have any friends, you can come talk to them. It's okay, I mean, if no one else cares about you, you know that the painted buffalo will. Bartlesville defines the term patriot. Disco balls. Here we are at Washington Park Mall. It's one of Bartlesville's most happening spots. Uh, it contains numerous hot spots such as Dillard's, a legendary department store, J.C. Penney's, another legendary department store, Sears, Classy Kmart. Um, Buffalo Wild Wings is the newest addition. It's a really great, fun, loud atmosphere. So pumping, you can't even hear each other talk. Um, the only downfall about Washington Park Mall is you have to get here before 9 and 6 on Sundays. Because the town starts to slow down a little bit before then. It must just be because of the wild weekends. I'm not sure, but it closes early. So, right now we're standing in front of a church in Bartlesville, one of many. It's a place that people can always go and feel welcome. It's an embracing, popular gathering area within our community. So when the mall closes early, you can always come to church and hang out with Jesus. Okay, apparently he goes to sleep at 9 o'clock too. We're standing here by my school, and apparently the big motion picture by Terrence Malick is filming here right now. Literally, you know, a couple floors above my college. And um, it's caused quite a controversy. The last day before fall break, students unable to focus on their midterm exams. Students running late for classes because they are unable to go on the elevators when they need to. I understand that Bartlesville rarely has any exciting figures come into town. But education needs to be a priority. And I want to know, when will this stop? So right now, we are sitting in front of the most happening breakfast joint in all of Bartlesville, Wheezy's Cafe. This place is so popular that it has supposedly become the breakfast spot for Bennifer while they are in town. Because of that, the traffic has increased so much that we're actually camping out here all night so we can get toast in the morning. Yes, because it would not happen otherwise. They get their very own building for it. Yeah, I heard that when Bennifer comes to eat breakfast, they clear everybody out and it's just them. Boom. How much up toast, that? Please. I haven't had a waffle in four weeks. Thanks, Bennifer. Right now, I'm standing by a field on Madison Boulevard in town. This recently has become a major hotspot in Bartlesville because the film crew has been filming here. Rumor is, is that this is actually Javier Bardem's Taco Mayo Cup. People have been coming here to worship it almost daily. The cool thing about Bartlesville is that we attract a lot of celebrities and films. For example, Christian Bale was here for, I don't know what reason, but he went up to the copper. And um, let's see, Rachel McAdams is here, you know, the girl from The Notebook. Let's see, Ben Affleck. Who? Ben Affleck. And um, that name sounds really familiar. What was he in? You know, like Dogma and Chasey Amy. 
Oh, oh, yeah, I know who you're talking about. Double chin dude. That's right. Double All right, chin double dude. chin dude. So, right. in your opinion, Kate, do you think that Bartlesville truly competes with, you know, really high, top-notch cities such as New York City and L.A. and in the fact that we have all these stars coming here? Oh, absolutely. Why else would they come here? I mean, Oklahoma has been home to many movies. Twister? Who was in Twister? Oh, you know that blonde chick? Uh, I don't really see her. Oh, Helen Hunt. That chick. She was in it. Oh, oh I, I thought she died. She might have. She died oh. cinematically. Haven't seen her for years. All right, so close enough. Possible. It's pretty much one in the same. <laughs> entirely possible. All right. Is there a certain reason why you're here today, or just because? I'm here today for the celebrity sightings. Honestly, I haven't seen Jennifer Gardner yet, and I haven't seen Javier Bardem. But I have seen Ben Affleck at Weezy's Cafe once. I was just walking by. It was crazy. So I hope to spot some more celebrities today. It's going to be a stock fest. It's going to be so awesome. Okay, so this is the new Hilton Garden Inn. This is where all the celebrities have been staying. So what I've been doing is camping out here night and day, trying to find these celebrities, and maybe we'll find one. I don't know, but all I'm saying is I need to find them before I just snap. Oh my god, I'm just really, really excited right now. So uh, I'm gonna go back to the campsite and do a little bit of watching and waiting. never believe this. I was on my celebrity stock fest. I found fucking hit girl. And it just sucks that Holly's gonna be at work all night and I saw fucking hit girl. I'm gonna have to call her right now. I'm kind of having a mental breakdown. I'm freaking out and um, I think I see her over there. I'll see you later. Get that out of my fucking <laughs> Yep. Yeah, I'm out. Yeah. Jesus saves. <laughs>